uh, you, why don't you, you you're, but you're probably better at starting these up. Why don't you go first? Okay. Hello, everyone, and welcome to episode eight of Leaf Play Starbound, which is a joint venture with my good friend John Markley over here. Hey, everybody. And um, we're just gonna sort of. Lo 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 Logan's over for out. a visit on my ship this episode. Yeah, I'm, I'm hanging out on his ship, which is exceptionally festive. I. I didn't invest at all in Christmas attire, but uh, John, you here, you've really, really taken this to heart, haven't you? Yeah, the, the stockings have been hung by the chimney with care, as you can see. Right, oh, not you, you bastard! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I knew you were gonna say that. I could, I couldn't resist just, well, just shutting that down. On the plus side, if, if anyone here didn't know about the trick where you. Hitting the hitting the stockings turns them into coal. If you've you've got some valuable gameplay information at least. Yeah, which I didn't know that. I keep throwing out uh, holiday spirit. I could have been making that into coal because it only takes like what one. Oh yeah, it's one holiday. Yeah. 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 So. That, that's that's what you, that's what you get for your you know unchristmassy Scrooge like ways. <laughs> yeah, it's if Scrooge only knew the the worth of coal in this game, he would he wouldn't mind. Uh, Actually, you know what? He wouldn't change a thing because he's a dick and gets coal anyway. So, so, so is, is my guy Cratchit in this scenario then? How does uh, that work? I, su I suppose. I don't know. I'm a I'm a plant person, so I don't know where that stands. There aren't any ghosts in this game, at least not that I know of. Wait till the wait till the Halloween DLC. Oh, they, I hope they do some. This this makes uh, me kind of expect holiday themed stuff. I'm guessing the. Terraria always did, always does like Christmas and Halloween. And yeah. All right. Well, anyway, that's all. That's all. You know. So we've side just stuff. we've just reached a new uh, a new planet. Uh, yes, uh, I in in your solar system, obviously, because yes. your ship. So. Yes. You know, we'll we'll go explore this that. Is, this is fresh territory, and. All right, ready to go. It begins. All right. Okay. Oh, oh god, this is beautiful. Yeah. This is way better than my shitty planet. You were on that, you were on like the planet of the eyeballs, weren't you? Or was that uh, a few videos ago? I, that might have been a few, few videos ago. I, you know, they kind of, they string together sometimes when they keep resetting these characters. And sometimes, like, I, I have to go back and watch my last video just to make sure that I, I even know what I'm talking about. Also, I, I have my, uh, I have, like, just a, a character for personal use that I have a lot more time on, and, you know, it's a lot to keep track of. I love the fact that, because, like I said, no, you, th no, you said you've never actually played Terraria, right? No, I've never played Terraria. I probably should. I, I don't know why I haven't. This is, I like this addition to it that the, uh, the trees actually fall over. In Terraria, oh, yeah. the... In Terraria, you just kind of, you whack them a while, and then they just explode into logs. Oh, no, yeah, the, the tree fall, it's so satisfying. It is. Uh, so, uh, you, I, you come here, my first comment is, oh, what a beautiful planet. They just immediately oh, yeah, clear-cutting. Cutting Whoa! Uh, is this guy friendly? Oh, he's not. This guy wants to kill us. He's got some sort of red dealy bopper antenna on his head. Yeah, he does. He looks some iron. Take that. Oh, and some that. snow. Th what is that, snow? Yeah, there's snow here. Snow and ice and... I, I, I live in Chicago, you'd think I'd recognize it better, but... <laughs> I, I'm really kind of uh, surprised at how many different, like, snow slash ice combinations there are in this. Because there's, like, there's snow and there's Ooh, ice and I found an igloo! Slush. Oh! I wonder if anybody lives here. There's a fire burning inside, but... Sometimes... Oh, nice. I just got this new sword in a chest. Uh, it's... Looks pretty good. I it's I don't the think I have anything. <laughs> oh, th this is fitting. It's sloppy bastard sword. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, those that's, uh. That's not they, very nice of the game, but they they always start out with these really uh sort of just like this weapon's shit sort of names, and then they they move up to 
uh, like, you know, badass human slayer and stuff like that. Well, the Terraria, in Terraria items, they had, like, pre prefixes as well, although I don't know if Sloppy was one of them. Up we go. Into the water here. Ooh. Yeah, I have a green flashlight. Oh, how, where'd you get that? I just found it in a box. It was, it was weird. Like, uh, it was after one of the character resets. Oh, oh, I, oh, I found a flashlight that said yellow. I actually hadn't tried it yet, so it's actually colored. Oh, yellow. yeah. Yeah, you got yellow. For, for, oh, for, should... I should explain to everyone right here. I've basically, I have have almost no experience with this game. Oh, yeah, and I have I have tons of experience. Like, in my, in my personal one, which I should make a video just sort of, like, of me dicking around with it, because, like, I can fly, and I have a monster for a pet, and... Like it, it's yeah, you can you can basic you can basically make pokeballs in this game and capture baby monsters and then raise them, which I've only dabbled in, but like it, it that's a whole area of the game that I I should uh got some investigate further. Got some copper here. Oh, I could could use copper. Let's see, there's something up here, I think. Ah! Uh, I guess not. I don't know why I didn't just, like, punch a hole in this. Oh, God! Whoa! It's a per- it's a- Oh, no, that's you. Never mind. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's me. <laughs> you, you, will you will find, like, uh, NPCs, though, that you can, like, talk to. Some of them have shops. Uh, some of them just want to kill you. A lot of them do, actually. And I found whole villages of, like, different races. Some, sometimes they're a little uh, disturbing, though. Like, I found. Oh god, uh, let me put up a torch here. I got it. Like, if I can, oh, you got one? Okay. Uh, like, I found areas where it's like, uh, like a Florin community that at first seemed like it was really nice and. That's your species, and stuff. right? Yeah, it's my species, and I was, I was like, going through and just checking out the dialogue of them, and it's like, the, if you. If you follow their rules, like keep your weapons away and stuff like that, they're really friendly and whatever. Mm -hmm. But if you if you go out of line, they threaten to kill you and eat you. So really? it's like cannibalism is the punishment for Harsh. violating their laws. It takes a weird turn. It's like it's like some weird Star Trek episode where they go to like the planet of the friendly aliens, but then they violate some obscure local taboo and must be put to death. Yeah, or it's like it's like one of those things where it's like, oh, this seems like the perfect little neighborhood, except, uh-oh, everyone's a cannibal. Yeah. Tonight on the outer limits. Yeah. Which I which I do like. It, like the uh, the exploration in this game is really well done. I think. You know, just because you find stuff like that, and I don't know if like, have you done any of the uh, like dungeons yet? No, not yet. Okay, because there's, there's a bunch that are like, um... Ooh, there's a whole bunch of water over there. Yeah, there's a little sort of, like, pond thing. I didn't see anything worth getting over there, though. I mean, um, you're just eviscerating this ice. Yeah. Well, I got a, I got a golden pickaxe, oh, okay. which cuts through pretty quickly. Uh, in, one, in my, you know, personal one that's a little further, I have, uh, like, drill. Which will just tear through pretty much everything. Okay. Um, how deep can you go? How deep? Yeah. Oh, uh, you can get down to, like, planet's core, which is, cool. depending on the size of the planet, you know, could be farther. Okay. Uh, it, you basically just hit a sea of lava, and you can't go any farther. Okay. And, uh, I don't know, you probably haven't noticed, but, uh, well, based on the, the gravity of this planet, I'd say it's probably not that big. Because the gravity does change depending on size of planet. That's that's, that's a neat. Yeah, they they just added that actually, okay. and I, I like it a lot, especially with like my character who can fly because that's Whoa, there's you can something only fly there. for a short while, but a, there's a native creature. Yeah, let's see. Uh, is he friendly? Oh yeah, he's friendly. Hey buddy. See, like the, one of these baby ones. If I had a, a capture pod, a, oh, a, a pokeball, I would totally just nab this guy up and he'd be my buddy. Okay. And it's pretty cool, like, they'll, uh, protect you in battle, and if they die, they just go back into their ball. Oh, okay. And they, uh, they have an evolution sort of system, I don't know if it's actually in-game yet, mm -hmm. 
uh, or if it's just planned, but... I don't know, that, that sounds really interesting to me. If only because I like Pokemon. Yeah, let's see. Uh, okay. There is... I don't know, have you come across Acid yet? I have not. Is that... Okay, there, there's like green water, and if you step in it, you'll be poisoned. And when you pointed the yellow... Thing oh, okay. Down, you know, I was like, oh no, don't do it. I, I have to keep reminding myself that this is a beta because, like, when it came out, it, it's it's so polished. Yeah, there's already a lot of stuff in here. Pretty... Yeah. I mean, I I've been playing for hours and I still feel like I've I've barely scratched the surface. Any, I mean, I've progressed to the end, but it's like there's different categories of planets. You know, like we're on a level one. Right. Uh, that will go up to a level ten, but. You, you're done progressing Oh, at... I think we've reached the end of the snow. Oh, yeah, it looks like it. Uh, but you're done progressing at level 5. So, like, my character's around a level 4, level 5 sort of gear, but I can visit level 10 planets, which are nightmarish and terrifying. Ooh, gravel. Yep. Wait, is it falling on its own? Oh, yeah, it'll fall on its own. Okay. Uh, All right, sand was sort of like that in Terraria. It... Yeah. Which this is oh th we'll be able to dig through this super quickly. Ah. And, oh, hang on, I'm gonna I'm gonna cause a cave in over here. Oh, duck oh, thing. There's some okay. sort of creature. Yeah, they're they're okay. They're all right. I, I was worried too, but now nah, they're they're friendly, friendly duck guys. As Except we, we just don't. collapsed their home. Oh God, I what? I inadvertently angered him. Well, way to screw up first contact, Logan. <laughs> oh, this guy's cool. The, the guy we the guy I killed must have been a jerk. He, the, this guy over here doesn't seem to mind at all. <laughs> I tried to get get like one of those little pixel capsules and it you just can, you can get your hell. species and theirs to generations of war. I hope you're pleased. Well, bring it. I'll ruin well, you are you are uh, you you apparently uh, devour people for my social transgressions. So I guess. Yeah. Oh no, oh, this guy this guy's angry. Okay, you got it. You should probably like lead the way since you have the badass weapon. It's up here. Oh, what do you look at? Look at this. We had this whole way, like, we were digging. Mm -hmm. If we were just like, oh, for... a, a few blocks to the right, and we could have just walked on down. Ah. <laughs> well. This is, a, this is what we get for not paying attention. Well, we're engrossed in the spirit of discovery or something. And... Yeah, well, uh, digging down. That's one of those things, like, when you play this game, it's... It's always like there, there's probably something just right, you know, five blocks to the right, but you'll never notice. Sure. Uh oh. I'm getting uh, I'm getting a little cold. Are you getting that? A little meter at the bottom? Yeah. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, oh, it, uh oh. It's the hamburger helper mascot. <laughs> oh, and he's he's mad. He's make, and he makes sheep noises. Yeah. Okay. Uh, how how's your how's your warmth meter doing? I'm still. It's just starting to appear. I'm still up at the top. Okay. Uh, it will it will grow if you're not uh, near torches. Th that that'll keep you warm, depending oh, okay. on how cold the area is. Okay. Um, so like if you're in the in the tundra, you might need a couple torches and a campfire to stay warm. But if you're in just sort of like you know an area like this, one torch will be fine. Does water make you colder? Not to my knowledge. I believe it's just location. Okay. Uh, but I I could be I could be off on that. Oh god. I got it. <laughs> Thank you. I miss my like overpowered flying character with the laser beam. Well, you got uh, got too used to being too powerful, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Th th that tells me that I need I need to be making uh. Making more videos with this guy, to be honest. Victory has defeated you. <laughs> yeah, I was uh, I was slacking too much over oh. winter break because oh, here we go. What is that thing? I don't know. But I'm gonna kill it. Uh, what was I saying? I was I was slacking too much over winter break because I was traveling and stuff. And then there was that critique video which took like a week and a half to do. Yeah, that looked cool. Thank you. Go that watch it. If, if you're not watching this on Logan's channel, go to, what, is it hollowed, hollowed underscore leaf? Uh, no underscore. It's hollowed leaf LP, all one word. Um, okay. The reason it is, 
like that is I am dumb and um, so I wanted that in like my Xbox. Oh, Live now I'm getting pretty. And... I'm pretty pretty cold now. Oh, are you? Oh, yes. Yeah, so I'm, I'm like I'm, I'm like a third I'm... of the way down the thermometer. Oh, there's Ooh. some silver. Oh, and I'm starving to death. I'm not paying any sort of attention. Can, I've got uh, if I've got food. I could get. Can I give you food or? Uh, you can. I should be fine for okay. now. I've got a I've got a whole pile of meat and, that I'm hauling around with me. Oh yeah, I got. Well, I have a bunch of raw meat. I should have cooked it before. Starting this, but now you're gonna get like botulism or something. Oh yeah. Well, I, I, you can't. I don't think you can eat it raw. Actually, let me try it. Nope. You have to cook it. Um. Anyway, so the origin of my name, right? Um. If we keep digging down, you know, eventually we're gonna hit the core. It'll start to heat up again. And it'll. I, I would assume so. I mean, it would. You think it'd have to? But I'm gonna keep digging. I'm gonna steal a couple of these torches back since we're not using them. Um, hit some sand. Okay, so sand collapses as well. Right? Yeah, sand, sand and gravel collapse. I think those are the only ones. But causing cave-ins, while mildly hazardous to your health, will make it a lot easier to, you know, sort of dig. So you don't have to worry about a lot of it. Oh, that's that's cool. The the cave in the, like the falling sand in. Oh, I think there's some copper in there. In, yeah, there is. In uh, Terraria, it basically it just like it, it'll like fall straight down in lines. Uh, it, it yeah. doesn't. It, this is, so this is a lot more sort of fancy. Oh yeah, this will like you know it'll kind of like fall down. I think there's like some iron there and stuff. Oh, there's a whole treasure trove of copper. Oh, it's fine sand. Is that a difference between fine sand? And oh yeah, I think. Uh oh, sand. watch out! There's some water up there. Oh, well, the sand, here it comes. Oh, ah! 